Developing news tonight in San Francisco. A muni bus slams into a car, pushing it a full block until a passenger jumped in to help. Good evening, everyone. I'm Carolyn Johnson. And I'm Dan Ashley. It happened on Masonic Avenue at the Panhandle in San Francisco. ABC 7 News reporter Ama Dates is there live to explain exactly what happened here, Ama. Dan, the initial accident happened at the far intersection where you see the red lights are flashing. The muni bus jumped on the curb, went over the grass, and stopped right before Fell Street. This muni bus crashed in a spectacular accident at Masonic and Oak shortly before 6.30. A muni spokesperson says the driver of this Volkswagen made an illegal turn in front of the 43 Masonic bus. For unknown reasons, the bus kept going. It just didn't stop. I kept waiting for it to stop. Jesse Williams was on his bike at the corner of Masonic and fell when he saw the bus and car careening toward him. Once I got halfway through the grass, I was thinking, oh my God, it's not going to stop. And we quickly ran away, but it was, it was a narrow miss at that point. Police say someone on the bus ran to the front to help stop it. Williams went to check on the driver of the Volkswagen. I was surprised. He was like, I'm okay, I'm okay. He's, he's probably shocked now, but he was in really good shape then. If there was a passenger in there, they'd probably be dead now. Amazingly, the only injury was to the bus driver, who was taken to SF General for back pain. We saw the, the bus and the car here and amazed that uh, there's no fatalities from it. This just uh, an amazing destruction of a vehicle. Gabriel Kolaluka was walking home and couldn't help but stop and stare at the wreckage. I felt bad for uh, some of the bicyclists that had their bikes pinned between the cars and the bus on the way here. But uh, it seems that they got them back and they didn't seem that much worse for wear. It took about three hours to finally get the scene cleared. Ama Dates, ABC 7 News.